Live from Fargo and serving you on TV, online, and on the go. This is Valley News Live at 6. A man is in custody tonight after pulling a gun on another person, making threats that forced police to call in the SWAT team. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Krista Bame. A man is being charged for terrorizing after pulling a gun during an argument in a Grand Forks hotel parking lot. After a four-hour standoff, officers were able to take the man into custody. Valley News Live's team Macy Anger joins us live with more. Macy? Yeah, Krista, it's hard to tell anything happened here at America's Best Value Inn. But just a few hours ago, Grand Forks police officers and SWAT team surrounded this area, even blocking off a few streets. Officers say Daniel Tuba got into an argument with another man in this parking lot, and that's when witnesses say he pulled out a gun and threatened the man before going back into his hotel room. Now, when officers arrived, they evacuated a portion of the hotel, about 10 people. Now, those people are back in their rooms right now. Officers say at a point in the negotiation, because of Tuba's threats, they had to use a flash grenade. Now, no one was hurt, and Tuba did eventually come out of his room peacefully. Right. At one point during negotiations, uh, the suspect had uh, made comments to the effect that, uh, you know, there's only one police vehicle that he can see and, and it must not be that important for him to come out or something along those lines. Um, he wasn't really cooperating at that point. Um, so uh, the decision was made that we needed to ensure he understood that uh, this was a serious matter and, and uh, we were taking it serious. Now, Tuba has been charged with terrorizing. Officers say they, ha they don't know and haven't released specifics on how that argument started. Krista? All right, thank you, Macy. And we'll continue to keep you updated on the latest developments here on Valley News Live and valleynewslive.com.